Hello and welcome. In this video we're looking at the pre-season transfer objective card for Tangai Ndombele. Uh, he's moved from Spurs in the Premiership um, over to Napoli in Serie A. So as a Frenchman in Serie A I think you can suspect what some of these objective parts may be made up of. Um, we'll have a look at the card to start with. As you can see he's got 90 rated stats all over the shop. Um, he's got the um, nice, six 90 rated face card stats to start with which is always a good benchmark for an end game kind of midfielder like this as you can see the dribbling is lovely the pace is really good physicals and defending are also pretty solid as well I would probably go with a anchor card on this to improve those and up the pace a little bit um, five star weak foot is always a good thing plus medium medium work rate sits okay in the middle of the pitch um, the four sections that are used to complete him. The first one is French Maestro. You get a gold pack on its own for completing this one. You have to assist a goal using French players in five separate squad battles matches on minimum professional difficulty. So there's no need to win the game. It doesn't matter who scores the goal as long as the assist comes from a player with the French nationality, then you are okay. As you can see, um, as I'll show you later on in the in the squad that I'm going to be using, I've got a squad of entirely French players I'm going to be using. So if I get an assist, it will be from a French player because there'll be nobody else on the pitch. So you have to do this in five separate games. So it's not going to be the quickest objective to complete, but you get a gold pack. It works towards the card. It, so it makes sense. The second one up is Deadly Finisher. This is the easiest one here. Score four goals while having at least three French players in your starting 11. As I said before, my entire starting 11 is going to be French players, so it will work out fine for me straight off the bat. Um, you can do this all in one game. If you're on professional difficulty against a bronze and silver team, then you can probably do it fairly quickly. Um, with the last objective, the Gabriel Jesus one, I think I did it within the first half of a game. Um, as, it, as, it, as I said with the previous one, you don't have to win the match. As long as you score four goals, you can go ahead and lose 10-4 or lose 15-4. As long as you've scored the four goals while having three players in your starting squad, then it doesn't matter. You get a 75-plus rated rare player for this. Kind of underlining that it's one of the easier parts of the objective. Third one up is Threaded Beauty. Um, again, it's not a surprise that it's through balls and involves French players. So you have to assist three goals using through balls while having at least three French players in your starting squad. So, you don't have to win the game. You can do it all in one match. Doesn't matter what happens result-wise. You can lose 10-4, etc. But you get a premium gold pack if you assist those um, the goals using through balls. And obviously, this will combine with... Um, the first one assisting the goal with a French player and this one scoring goals with French players. So they all kind of work together. If you do one, then you do the others as well. Um, the last one up, Serie A Newcomer, which is what he is. You have to score using Serie A players in five separate squad battles wins on minimum professional difficulty. So as, you, um, as I'll show you right now, the squad that I've got has is entirely based of French players and... Um, so three of them are from Serie A, which means that Pogba will be doing all of my scoring as he is from Serie A. He will count towards that Serie A newcomer part of the objective. I've also got Mainyan and Malqui as the right back. As you can see, there have been so many French special cards throughout the game. They've just been picked up as we've gone along through playing the game. Um, French bench just because why not and a French manager to help with all the chemistry on the players so that's what I would do that's how I'm going to approach it it's all in squad battle so it's nice and easy um, you've got to play the full games um, but the win criteria isn't that um, mentioned in it so you should be fairly easy to do hopefully it all works and it all registers if you have any problems please let me know below and we'll see if anybody else is having the same issue that uh, you might be coming across and yeah hopefully it comes well it's a nice essentially free card there's no player exchanges involved or anything like that it is just um 
working through gameplay to get the objective card at the end of that. So yeah, well ended there. Thanks for watching, I appreciate that, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.